Welcome back to the Relaxing Ghost Channel here on YouTube. As always, your host with the most and with Max for this special video update. Got some WWE news here today. Max is afraid of cameras, so. We are back in the Relaxing Ghost Studios for another video. We got an injury update, but before I get into it, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Man, the, uh, the train never stops. The Grim Reaper is always around the WWE, and it's really sad, but, and unfortunate at the same time. Z Zack Ryder has been injured. He did something to his knee. Apparently, he's already gone to see, I think, Dr. Jim Andrews there in uh, Alabama, or it might be Youngblood, not sure, but his knee is blown out, folks. He blew a wheel out there, and uh, he's going to be out four to nine months, apparently, which puts him coming back for SummerSlam uh, around that time. You know, Zack Ryder's a guy that I don't think WWE is too high on. I I don't know why they probably keep him around because he you know he shows up to work with a good attitude. He's in great shape, and you know he can put on some decent matches here and there. So, um, you know, there is a use for Zack Ryder in the WWE. I think when he comes back, he does need to tweak his gimmick a little bit. And it sucks for Mojo Rawley, too, because him and Ryder just won the number one contendership for the tag titles on SmackDown. They probably weren't going to win the titles, but you never know. Never say never in WWE. And, you know, it really sucks for both of them because, you know, maybe they would have won the titles for a week and then boom. Wyatt's win them right back. I think that's a way to get the uh, Wyatt family over is to have them win a couple of titles. But back to Zack Ryder, he'll he'll be out probably the majority of the uh, nine months. And while we're on the subject of injuries, I heard the podcast recently with Shelton Benjamin. He's on his way to being cleared. He's having a very successful recovery and rehabbing his uh, shoulder there every day. And Finn Balor is in the same boat as uh, Shelton Benjamin. So look out to see both those guys in WWE very soon. Shelton Benjamin is a guy that I've, I've liked since the day I seen him in 2003. The guy has unlimited potential and it's up to WWE to, you know, give him the opportunity to uh, prove himself once again. And I I would say have Shelton come back and take that icy strap from, uh, from the Miz there. And, you know, it's a good way to come back. Shelton Benjamin was supposed to be on SmackDown anyway, so... Hope for that return soon, guys, and get well soon to Zack Ryder. This has been a little uh, WWE injury update, and we'll talk to you guys later. Peace.